All right, all right, all right. <laughs> hey, what is up, my friends? The champ is here, and I am not Kevin Hart, but he is definitely hilarious. I will link the video in the description below if you're up for a couple of lols. But anyway, long time no talk. I hope you've all been keeping well. I'm very well, thanks for asking. Jesus, you're so nice. But uh, I'm very late on the topics. It's been a while since I've done a video, but I will address them in this video right now. So are you ready? Cause here we go. So the Olympics have come and gone and Ireland won medals in the boxing and show jumper, which basically means we're good at riding and fighting. Uh, Bolt went absolutely beast in the 100, 200 and relay. But I am a bigger fan of Johan Blake. I just think he's very underappreciated as an athlete because of who Bolt is. And most of the media was fixated on him. But Blake has my respect and you know that means a lot to him. And of course the highlight of the whole Olympics was when Jessica Ennis won the heptathlon. That was definitely the highlight of the games for me by far. She's a great athlete, definitely deserving everything coming her way. But I'm going to stop talking about my crush and I'm going to get back to the gameplay. So it's a TDM on stadium. I'm performing like an Olympian myself actually. Otherwise I think we would have lost this game. And honestly that would have made me a very angry bear indeed. Now the class I'm using this game is the Rapid Fire MPL. Mainly because Rapid Fire on any SMG pretty much makes it all powerful. And I hope they bring back the Rapid Fire attachment in Black Ops 2 because that would be amazing. Now the perks I'm using this game is Ghost Fur Fur the Forces of Good. Okay. Now Kelly Clarkson says everybody's got a dark side mind's using ghosts sometimes, so you better not judge me or I will cut your dinner up and I will eat it in front of you. Yeah, you weren't expecting that. But then again she said what doesn't kill you makes you stronger, so if I have a FAMAS in my hand, then I'm pretty certain I'm gonna stay alive for a very long time. And if I had a FAMAS in my hand there, I probably would have been alive. You see what I mean? My logic is genius. Now my last two perks are Slide of Hemp Pro and Ninja Pro because people today in Black Ops are either really bad or they are super try hard. So I'm not taking any chances. Now, the topic I have for today is, it's a pretty interesting one. It's the value of video games. Like what do video games do for you? You hear so many people say, oh, you're wasting your time playing video games. I don't know why they went all ghetto, but they did. And I just want to punch those people in the face on my feet. Because uh, one, who the hell does that? And two, if it works, you look like a badass. But getting back on the actual topic. Some people are in a position where they are getting paid for playing video games. And I think that's amazing to be in that kind of position. So for the most part, what games do you guys play when you just want to chillax? Drop a comment in the comment section. Actually, no. Place it carefully in there because we might lose it. And I wouldn't want that to happen at all because I value your guys' opinion. Oh, me you ask? Oh, Jesus, you're very nice today. That's whatever's wrong with you. But, yeah, I've been playing Black Ops, Sleeping Dogs, and Minecraft pretty much. But we've Black Ops 2, Halo 4, and Tomb Raider on the way. And those games look absolutely amazing. Pretty much Black Ops and Halo 4 for shits and giggles and maybe Rage. We'll see soon enough how all that turns out. And Tomb Raider because the game itself looks absolutely fantastic. I can't wait to actually play that one. That's probably the game I'm most looking forward to playing. And she looks like Cheryl Cole and that is pretty much alright too. Now we are coming to the end of the commentary. I know. I know. It's a very sad time for all. If you have to cry I will understand. But it's a little bit weird. And I don't want to be a whore about it, but if you could leave a like or a dislike, I would definitely appreciate it. It will help me in a big way. But then again, it is up to yourselves, guys. I will leave that totally up to yourselves. Now, this might be my last commentary for a while because I will be posting Black Ops live sessions from here till Black Ops 2 release. The Black Ops 2 release, sorry. And I just gotta wait for Fat Ass to come on so he can record with me. <laughs> Richard, if you're watching, hello. Well, <laughs> well, he's not much of a Fat Ass, actually. He's actually a beast. But he's skinny, so he doesn't really make much of an effort at intimidation. But he's a good friend, and I'm giving him props in this commentary. Richard, I'm gonna make you famous, boy. And that's pretty much it, guys. So this is the People's Champion signing out. Thanks for watching, I hope you guys did enjoy, and I will see you next time. Deuces. 
Oh crap, I still have a lot more time left. Um, the reason I wanted to head off is because Supernatural is on in a bit and I kind of want to watch it and I don't want uh, this commentary to be taken up most of the time. Uh, while I'm here, uh, leave your thoughts on what Black Ops 2 looks like from the stream so far. Like to me, it looks pretty much amazing. Well, that's because I'm a big fanboy of Treyarch. But that seems to have filled out a gap there. All right, guys, uh, the People's Champ is yet again signing off. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Deuces. Bye. Shout <laughs> out to my boy T.W. Thomas, Mr. Sandwich, Chester, Dean Winchester. We doing a real B.I.G. Bye. Boom.